so let's see like uh, in ideally like what in reality the challenges and risks faced by the r and d we will just go through the processes in manufacturing most of them are fixed process you know that you know the the process conditions are all well established and uh, the change we, we don't tend to change do the change management very often whereas in the case of uh, r and d there's going to be like frequent changes we deal with unknown compounds our processes everything i think change in a very frequent manner so even sometimes we need to do some hundred or thousands of experiments within a month or within a year so that is the major difference and in terms of material you know you handle in large volumes and uh, we don't uh, use that often but whereas in r and d we use very small volumes but there is a wide range of chemicals or whatever and incidents in manufacturing as you all know it can be catastrophic but it will also impact the community as well the severity may be lower in man, uh, than in manufacturing but still it can be severe and um, it can affect the business continuity in also the pipeline now um, teams are all well qualified there the risk understanding also is uh, over the period of time it has evolved uh, whereas in the case of uh, r and d we do have people with uh, highly qualified with phd's and post doctoral people working on the r and d's but when it comes to the core r and d processes uh, in uh, with respect to safety and quality there is uh, less uh, awareness and uh, in case of equipment and uh, facility integrity management there the processes are all well established whereas it is there in terms of quality but uh, safety in terms of safety perspective we have to really have a, a deep dive in so uh, these are basically what we think is the difference between the manufacturing and the r and d processes 